What a treat we have for you this morning. Amy Evelyn is joining us now from the Maryland Zoo and she has brought some friends along with I her. I did. Thank Good you morning. for having us. Who is that? So this is Wade Boggs. He's a bog turtle. Um, he <laughs> is a name. critically endangered species. You can find them here in Maryland. They live where it's very marshy along the waterfront. Um, you can find them uh, in any kind of place where you can find like a natural spring or just really marshy tall grasses. They are critically endangered. They're little tiny turtles and they don't breed um, very, very well, but we do oh, have them no. at the Maryland Zoo. He's one of our traveling animal ambassadors and they're just really cool turtles. And believe it or not, this turtle is almost 15 years old. So they don't get very large. They max out at about four inches across on the shell or from uh, tip to tail on the shell. So it's not very big at all. Moody like a teenager? A little bit, yeah. yeah. Little he's bit. a cool tail too. Can he you turn does. So the tail? he's got kind of like that cool, fun snapping yeah. turtle ta tail and they use that to help push them through the mud and the muck. But uh, he's a cool little turtle. And the difference between him and Shelby mm -hmm, right here are three toed box turtle who is a little shy, mm -hmm. a little camera shy this morning. Um, he cannot totally close himself up in his shell. Shelby is a box turtle, so she can close herself up completely. There's a little, I little see her snout little poking eyes. out. And I feel movement in the palm of my hand, yes. so that must be where her feet are back here. That's right, so okay. she's got a hinge shell on the bottom. There, oh, there oh, she oh, is. Oh, come say hi. Um, and she's got, uh, she can pull her legs, head, tail, feet, everything in there, um, whereas the bog turtle and every other turtle cannot do that. They can pull their head and cover it with their front legs, but they can't go all the way in. Wow. Yeah, so this is a three-toed box turtle, a little bit different from the eastern box we have here. They're not as colorful. They live in a little bit sandier habitat. Um, um, but again, it's one of our animal ambassadors that you can see on grounds. Um, and I think, I think, I believe Wade or Shelby, one of the two of these are going to be at the um, animal outpost on grounds this morning so you can learn more about them. I'm just absolutely fascinated yeah. because her movements are almost imperceptible. Like I can feel her moving and you, we were just watching her shell open up. So yeah. it's so She's interesting. She's like a flower, a delicate flower. What is the kind of turtle that we might see on the road in Maryland? So you're going to see right now a lot of eastern box turtles. You can also see painids um, mm -hmm. and, and diamondbacks if you're uh, going by the coastline. Watch out for those because they will cross the road. The thing you want to do with turtles is always put them across the road the direction they're heading. Otherwise, they're just going to try to do it again and get it smushed. So they're all breeding right now. They all have very specific home ranges. The eastern box turtle, for mm -hmm. instance, has a one mile circular home range that they live in forever. So you never want to take them out of that unless wow. you absolutely have to. And safest way to pick them up? Um, well, if it's a snapping turtle, it's mm -hmm with a shovel and not near your fingers because right. they are very strong, but um, Eastern Box Turtle just pick them up by the shell, two hands, carry them across, wash your hands after because um, they do have salmonella. But come on out to the zoo today. We have Wild About Giraffe, which have nothing to do with turtles, but they're really no, cool too. They're awesome. Um, so Wild About Giraffe goes on from 10 to 4 today when we're open every day of the week, 10 to 4, um, and you can learn all about giraffe. You can also get tickets to our Guinness events. We have um, a partnership with Guinness since their, so new, cool. their new brewery and mm -hmm. um, Barrel House and they're going to have events at the zoo, tastings and fun things like that. And paint nights and junior photo safaris and overnights. So we have lots That's of things going cool on right now. a place to come hang yes. out with you at the zoo. All right.